Cash said, came to me on the bus, he said, Coach, if we win, can we eat at the Waffle House? So I looked at Ca Cash, I said, Cash, if you want to eat at the Waffle House, you better do something, and he did. Um, my personal favorite Waffle House, uh, I wish Pines had a Waffle House. I mean, I would trade in all the McDonald's and Bob Evans and everything in the world just for one Waffle House. So I'm going to go there and uh, I'm going to get a smithered, smothered, and covered all-star platter with a Sprite and two waffles. I'm going to go two waffles tonight. <laughs> All A State Baseball Tournament Weekend is here. A little flashback there to 2009. The thoroughbred himself, Cash Daniel, after a go-ahead homer wins Paintsville's quarterfinal game. And yes, he got to go to the Waffle House that night. So let's start with Hazard. Coach John Meehan and the Bulldogs trying to reach the All A Semis for the second straight season. Standing in their way, uh, Campbellsville. Top of the second, scoreless, two outs, and the bases are all juiced up for old Andy Baker. Bang! Cooks one up to right. That's a two RBI single. Hazard on the board, and it's two to nothing early. Dogs. Let's go top of the third now. Dalton Baker rolls a lazy ball down the third baseline. That's good enough, though, for Blake Knight at first to score from third. A three run inning for the Bulldogs, and they were up five to nothing. The Campbellsville pitching stat, they struggled against the Bulldog batters. Base is loaded, hit by pitch here. Seven to nothing, Hazard. Meanwhile, uh, Ryan Smith, he pitched six innings for the Dogs, five shutout innings, and then we got, we got Chase Ford, a.k.a. Slink. He finished the deal with a strikeout. Hazard advances to the semifinals 9-3 over Campbellsville. It means a lot. Uh, we've been here a lot of times, and uh, we haven't been able to get past the next ball game, so our focus is going to be on the semifinal game. And uh, I know these boys are ready, and uh, I love this bunch. I've got seven seniors, and, uh, you know, this is their last shot, so I know they're going to come ready to play tomorrow. 